Wearing an Accutron powered by an electrostatic movement is not like wearing any other watch. At a glance, it clearly looks different with a skeletonized dial that appears to be a cross between a watch movement and a sci-fi machine. But more important than looking different, it actually is different. The Accutron electrostatic movement features technology never before used in a wristwatch. It's groundbreaking, and as such, it's going to draw attention from those around you. So we figured we'd give you a little primer on how it works. The Accutron features an electrostatic movement, but what does that mean? Typically, watches feature either mainsprings or batteries to power their movements, but not the Accutron. As the name suggests, it uses electrostatic energy instead. Inside of the Accutron electrostatic movement is a miniaturized Wimshurst machine. Invented in the 1880s by British inventor and engineer James Wimshurst, it consists of two glass discs positioned very close to each other, with metal foil panels attached to their surfaces at regular intervals. The discs are spun in opposite directions by a mechanical force. By passing closely to each other, positive and negative charges are created and organized on opposite panels. These charges are collected, amplified, and stored in capacitors until they reach a threshold when they are released as harnessable electricity. If you look at the dial of the watch, you'll notice three circular openings with what appear to be turbines inside. Right now, we're looking at the two smaller openings toward the bottom of the dial. That tiny little contraption actually consists of three discs, two stationary with a mobile disc between. As that disc spins, it creates opposing charges that are collected and stored until, boom, lightning in a bottle. But now you might ask, what spins those discs? Inside of the movement is a rotor, just like in an automatic mechanical movement. This rotor moves when you do, which through a mechanical gear train, spins the disc in the generator. The power is stored so the watch keeps running even when you're not wearing it, and also sent out to the brain of the watch, which among other things, features a high accuracy quartz oscillator used as a reference signal for keeping very accurate time. But the Accutron still has one more trick up its sleeve. Remember that other opening on the dial, the big one? Well, that isn't a generator, it's a motor, an electrostatic motor to be precise, that's used to drive the seconds hand, another first in watchmaking. The result is a perfectly smooth, sweeping seconds hand. No ticking, like on typical quartz or mechanical watches. Was this needed? Well, no, but it does speak to the Accutron story. The original Accutron watches from the 1960s predated quartz technology, instead using tuning forks to create a signal. The high frequency vibration of the forks translated into a smooth, sweeping seconds hand. The electrostatic movement was created to celebrate the 60th anniversary of the original Accutron. And as such, the electrostatic motor is both a nod to the innovation of the originals and a poetic reminder of that smooth motion. The Accutron electrostatic movement isn't just another timepiece. It's a conversation piece and a piece of history on your wrist.